This is Napoleon Wilson. Got a smoke? I want you to know something, Wilson. Now, I don't enjoy driving anybody to death row. You try anything, anything. I've got two guards with shotguns, and I'll blow you apart. Sure could use a smoke. You understand me, Wilson? You mumble a little bit. I get the general idea. Let's go. Slip right out of the chair. Yeah. I don't sit in chairs as well as I used to. Get him up. All right, let's go. I'm all jealous of you, Wilson. You get all this VIP treatment. Here they let me walk around almost free. Hey. What? You got a smoke on you? Yeah, but I'm not gonna give it to you. Why not? Not good for you. Smoking can kill you. Uh, you don't like competition, huh? You think you're real fancy, don't you? I have moments. All right, knock off the talk and let's move. Move. <coughs> OK, if I uh, stretch a minute. You got to chain me to a seat and drive for hours. We get to Sonora, you're gonna chain me in a cell. Maybe for as long as 90 years. Change is all I got to look forward to. Grant. You know, Wilson, I gotta miss you. That's not the truth, Warden. <laughs> now, you should always tell the truth. Even a little white lie. Sometimes trip a man up. He don't stand up as good as he used to. You don't mind if I sit down a minute or two, Davis? Got a smoke on you? You asked me before. Well, I never got a definite answer. I don't smoke. That's a definite answer. Another one gone. When you're in my position, days are like women. Each one is so goddamn precious. They always end up leaving you. What do you want? Why, do I have to want something? You're a cop. You're either curious about me, or you want to give me some shit. I don't understand you, Wilson. Curious. You're not a... You're not a psychopath. You're not stupid. I am an asshole. Can't take everything away from me. Why did you kill those men? Everybody asked me the same question. I always tell them the same thing. First time I ever saw a preacher, he said to me, son, there's something strange about you. You got something to do with death. Being real young, I believed him. Turned out he was right. That's no answer. I thought it was pretty good. Where'd you get a name like Napoleon? I'll tell you sometime. When? The moment of dying. <laughs> I'm gonna do my best to be there when your time comes.
Isn't that uh, overdoing it a little? Napoleon Wilson. No kidding. Got a smoke? No. Sorry. Well, uh, you see one floating around. Snag it for me, will you? Maybe a sick man back there. Just pass him through. <laughs> I have to admit it, Wilson. You do have some fancy moves. For a man in leg irons. You're not going to let us sit in here. At least take these cuffs off. Hey, hey! You both all right? Fabulous as usual. What's happening out there? Hey, come on. We got a right to know what's happening. Left out again. Life just seems to pass us by, doesn't it? Come on, baby. Hurry it up. Okay. Get out front. Oh. Quick. Move! You saved my life. Twice now. Twice? First time outside by the bus. I figured that was a mistake on your part, so I let it go. Then you did it again when you pulled us out of the cells. You must be serious about keeping me alive. I want all of us alive. This time I know somebody hurt us. 
There'll be squad cars here in five minutes. Settling. If a stray bullet had hit this. Come look at this. How is it? I can't move it, and it hurts like a son of a bitch. Close timing in there. You were good. If I'd been any good in here, maybe she'd still be alive. They moved the cars. I can't believe it. They parked them where they were before. Why'd they do that? From a distance, the street looks normal, like nothing happened. Like nothing happened? They gunned down five police officers, a secretary, one prisoner, we kill a dozen of them, and that's nothing happened? Where are the bodies? Took him away. How'd they do it so fast? Maybe they got the good fairy to help them. You really are a smart ass. Don't forget the cholo. They delivered it to us. Cholo? You look like somebody spit in your socks. This can't happen. Not in the, in the middle of a city. Not today. Then let's pinch each other and wake up. Very close timing. You are good. Sometimes. Anybody got a smoke? Got a light? Looks pretty good to me. Looks like hell. It's all we got. Between me and Snow White. Shit! Shit, shit! What's wrong? We haven't flipped a coin yet. I'm gonna lose. You got a bad attitude, Wells. I always lose. I've had bad luck all my life. Now, how do you think I ended up in here? Maybe it'll change. It might. If we don't flip a coin. Let's do something else. What? Potatoes. Okay. One, day, two, day, three, day, four, five, day, six, day, seven, day, more. Eight, day, nine, day, ten, day, eleven. Kiss my ass and go to heaven. Why, oh, you spelled you. I told you I'd lose. God damn it, we're gonna do it again. Hey, hey, there isn't time. Five feet down to the sewer, 20 yards straight ahead to the manhole. Right. What I want to know is, what the hell's the difference between this and what I was going to do 10 minutes ago? No difference. But you stopped me then. Why not now? One thing. When you get out of here, make sure you call the cops before you take off for the border, huh? Now, what makes you think I'd do that? I'll see you, Wilson. A 
basement's not a bad place to be if they come at us again. The only way in is down that long, narrow hallway. We might be able to hold them back for a couple of minutes. We'll be trapped down there. But we're not going to last up here with only eight shots between us. The upstairs is out. It's wide open up there. Someone will come. A man with faith. A rare quality. What about you? I've never had too much faith in anyone coming to my rescue. Maybe you've been associating with the wrong people. I've been with policemen for five years. That's enough to grow hair on a rock. And you? I believe in one man. Bitches! Too bad, Wells. You never got to see the border. We better get down in that basement. Look, we're out of time, out of ammunition, just like Wells. We're out of luck. Take a look. You still have the gun? Two shots. Do I save it for the two of us? You save them for the first two assholes who come through that vent. They're bound to see Wells come up out of the manhole. What do I use on the rest of them that come climbing through? Then you'll have to wing it. I'm curious about one thing. Just one? No, there are other things. But at the moment, this one interests me the most. What's that? Why don't you climb through that vent and take off down the sewer in the other direction? Well, there are two things a man should never run from, even if they cost him his life. One is a man who's helpless and can't run with you. What's the other? Come here a minute, Wilson. The very least of our problems is we've run out of time. That's an old story with me. I was born out of time. Settling tank. Magnesium flares. We strap the flares onto the tank. We tie them both up on that pipe. I stand in the doorway with my rifle. I shoot the flares. They ignite the tank. We blow the hell out of everybody in this hallway. Now, what's going to keep it from blowing the hell out of us? You hold up that sign in front of the door for cover. Can you hit it from there? I got three shots. That's enough. Can't argue with a confident man. Sorry. Kind of pretty. Can I ask you a question? Being a cop, I figured you'd get around to it eventually. How did you come to be named Napoleon Wilson? I'll tell you sometime. When will you tell me? Make it a minute or two. Anybody got a smoke? We have a stretcher for you, miss. Miss!
Get away from me! It would be a privilege if you'd walk outside with me. I know it would. <laughs> You're pretty fancy, Wilson. I have moments. 